Hello everybody, welcome or welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be setting up for quite a few comebacks. Many of the groups that um, I'm collecting are having comebacks. And I also have a new group that I decided to collect. Um, maybe wrong timing, <laughs> to be honest, with all these comebacks. However, I'm keeping it as a lighter collection, like... Uh, when there aren't many activities, probably like, you know, when end of the year awards are coming and stuff like that, when there aren't as many comebacks as there would be like now so that everybody can participate in those awards. So anyways, um, so that's what we're doing today. Um, if you'd like, uh, grab a drink, you know, plan store cards, pack mail. This is just gonna be a chatty, putting stuff away video. Okay, so we're gonna be starting with Boy Next Door. They're having a comeback with uh, 1999, September 9th. So, um, I did wanna set up for Jaehyun. So I'm very aware I am not even done the Earth, Wind, and Fire comeback, but that's okay. So I put it right now for nine cards. We'll see with the template. We'll see if I want to collect more. I think there's like another version also that I haven't really included in here. I think I only included the the album versions like not special album versions so um so i have the nice version so i'll start with that one there's two and then there's an id the only thing i'm not sure is if, if there's just one id for all the versions or if there's one id per version so i'm not sure about that but we'll see. So for now, I'm gonna keep it like this and then depending on what happens when it comes out and when I s or like when more album details come out, I might change it. But for now, so far like all of Boy Next Doors comebacks have been uh comeback well releases have been quite good so and the boys seem very excited for this one here so i'm very excited with them okay so i still have like one of their who versions i still have four House and 1999 is here. Okay, well, that's it for now. It's not like a high priority. I don't even think a medium priority collection, so I'm not really concerned. But we'll get there when we get there. So I'm pretty sure, as you all know, Zero Base One are also making a comeback. And for this one here, I'm actually gonna put a whole bunch of new sleeves. I was gonna film this over the weekend and I'm glad I waited. Um, because I had a feeling they were going to release the Zero's version, so I was waiting for that. So we're going to go all the way to the back. And again, like, my, you had me at hello, I'll, like, goes, haven't even arrived yet. So, like, that's going to be fun. Okay, so... 
You might be wondering, like, where are the units, Jennifer? I decided to put, because I have four spaces left in my other binder for units, I decided to put those in with, in my Zhang Hao binder, and then um, leave this one here without it. However, I think I'm just gonna put all of them in and see what happens. This time there are nine unit pieces. Um, and that fits a nine pocket. Why do I not know how to put this in? Okay. So I have, um, again, I'm not gonna fill them out like I did the, um, the other ones, like one per. I'm just gonna put one for in the middle and then we'll just go from there. So we'll start with the romance version. I'm gonna put it in Tara's spot. And then there's a romance behind photo sticker. I didn't do the the other behind sticker that came with the um that you had me at Hello Zero's version. I'm still uncertain if I want to, but I'm gonna do it for this album, I think. Then there's the science fiction version. Okay. After that, there's the circle pieces. Now, I'm not sure if it's gonna fit here. So if they don't fit in here, I'm just gonna put them in the other binder. I still kind of want to store them, so I will be doing that. So I'll put the circle pieces here. And then the digi packs are back. And I did buy another OT set, and they have two again this time. So the, I put the black back and the white back. And then the Zero's version, which has the selfie version, version, the selfie photo card, and the units. And then there's one in the back, which is great. We'll keep the one in the back. Okay, so welcome a new era. The boys seem so excited about it. The trailer dropped today and it looks so, so good. I'm absolutely obsessed. Um, honestly, I think it's gonna be such a good time. Not even gonna say it, like, it, it really does. Oh, when everybody's head is in it and everybody's excited, like, you know it's gonna be good. You know it's gonna be so good. So we're going to leave it at that for now. I'm probably gonna get an OT9 Zero's version like through K-Town, probably. I'm not sure if I want to bring it with my, like order it with my La Seraphim albums, but I might. Okay, so now we're headed to my A5 binders. I'm gonna go down a little bit. Okay, so they do have the same, actually the same amount of cards 
as last comeback. So Dripping came back with The weekend, or just sorry, weekend, on Monday, and it sounds so, so good. It's like Free Pass 2.0, but like more mature. I don't know, I really like it. And they also dropped their LA, like kind of performancey ish video today. And, uh, oh, it, it's so good, guys. I need Drippin' to be much bigger than they are. But, like, already their album sales have hit over a hundred thousand, which is so insane to me that that doesn't even make sense. Like, and it's only their ever, um, sorry, their ever version because the weekend version is only gonna be released on the 23rd. So it hasn't even counted those ones yet. Obviously, like the ever versions are the ones with like the goes and people are hosting and like they have the, the pre-order benefits and stuff. But like, oh my God, that is insane. That is actually insane. I'm so ready for Drippin' to get out of Nugudem. Like, absolutely. Ugh. So anyways, enough of the yapping. Um, so... I did put some pages. Did I put enough? One, two, three, four, five. I did. Okay. So, um... I know I was waiting for like the the third generation kit third yeah their third generation kit for their uh dreamin uh what do you call them the fan kits to come but like I checked weavers and it still hasn't shipped or anything and I think I bought it in like April so we're doing so well guys so anyways so um, for, also, uh, for their weekend album, I think what I'm seeing, and if I understood it correctly, we're gonna get, um, two full sets of PCs inside their weekend, weekend album, which is why it's so expensive, comparatively. So... That's good because like it's expensive. Oh. So the reason why I'm doing this, like I'm putting them all in here instead of like my zero base one binder, like I'm not filling it completely with sleeves is because I use different sleeves for my drippin collection. I use the um, Dragon Shield Japanese sized and they're like kind of the same or like just a itty bitty bit smaller than the Ultra Pros. So by opening them, like opening the sleeves a bit, it helps fit the PCs in more easily outside version I think I am gonna make a template for their ever version though I haven't seen one yet I mean it's still early obviously and a lot of people if they ordered their ever version they probably also ordered some um, weekend version, so it might not have arrived to them yet, like me. Okay, so we have both the studio and the outside version. And now for the ever versions, I only have one coming, but because I'm in perm claims, I am um, like, I decided to get plus inclusions as well. 
so I don't have to worry about buying it separately. Oh, and I also, so I, I just shipped a Neokio package. So that should be coming, if not by the end of this week, at the early next week. I filmed part of my haul vi video for the Poke Market part of it. And, but the next one, um, so I got some more Yunsung POBs that we didn't have goes for. They were selling them on sets. Guys, if you want to collect dripping, they're so easy to collect. They are so easy. So like, just so you know, they're very inexpensive. On uh, Mercari Japan, they have so like many PCs, like in bundles for so inexpensive. I've been putting um, Weekend on my streaming playlist with um, Zero Base One's brother. And a few other songs I wanted to stream. It's like maybe like a 20 minute playlist. So I've been listening to this song a lot. I'm excited to see their full choreography. It seems so cute and so like happy, light and fun. So. Okay, so so studio outside their QR blue back and white back. I think they're also pretty cohesive sets, even like they're outside in their studio version. I believe. Because like for Beautiful Maze, for like their QR code and their like polka albums, they were cohesive. They all did the same pose, but for their album version, they just did n'importe quoi, you know? Okay, so that's it for my OT6 drip and binder. And lastly, guys, I have a new binder, fresh out of packaging. Um, I had it for a while. I just wasn't sure uh, who I wanted to put in here. And if you've seen La Seraphim's newest comeback, Crazy, like their inclusions, they actually have quite a bit. Hold up. Like, what is this? This is crazy. So, <laughs> so anyways, I decided I'm gonna move them, I'm gonna move them out of here. The only thing is I don't have a separator 
because my newest group is also gonna be in here. But it doesn't have the same, I don't have proper separators. So anyways, for now, we're gonna put Little Miss Miss. Oh shoot, right, I used, give me a second. Okay, so we're gonna switch to the single pocket Meow Cafe. So La Seraphim, I'm actually really, like, because they do have quite some time in between comebacks, like, I'm all caught up with La Seraphim. So, I use the A5 uh, 68 by 93 four pockets because they fit the dragon shields. Actually, ugh, I keep not being sure. I guess I'll put the other girlies on that side. Okay, so I'm not sure how I feel about the concept. Or like, I saw some of the image teasers. I'm unsure how I feel about it. So I'm also unsure if I'm gonna be getting uh, the albums this time or if I'm just gonna buy them afterwards. So that's my, my dilemma because I used to really like their photo books. They had some really good concepts, but I don't know. So for these ones here, sorry, I didn't realize it was this quick. So these are all the album photo cards. Uh, so there's volume one, two, and three, and then there's an ID. So I decided to put it in here. And then for their Weavers, they have a Weavers version A and Weavers version B. But I think it all fits on one page as well. It's just their Digipack that doesn't. So I'm gonna put the QR and then the unit kind of like this. And then I'll just put like selfie one. Oh my God. Cause I think the, the QR is also a unit. So it just kind of works out. Kind of like that. And then Version B. I might get their, I'm probably gonna get actually their Weavers versions. I'm probably gonna order that with the Zeros version. And I, cause I believe their comebacks are like quite close to each other. So, so I might do that. And then Oh, that was actually the perfect amount of sleeves. I love it when that happens. So they're compact. They have one, two, and three. Oopsies, put another one. So from what I saw, I know that one of them is like a vertical one. I'm not sure how I feel about that. Um, and because there's three, uh, I don't know if I should keep just like a random extra unit or or put like um what should I put which I even put um or like maybe a POB but I have a page for POBs which is why I'm kind of but I also have other POBs scattered around so you know what I'll probably just put 
a, P, a POB here. I think that's what I'm gonna do. Okay, and so I don't know if I wanna buy an extra one of these and then I'll kind of put it in between or maybe just the larger inclusions are okay. I don't know. I'm not sure how I feel about that. So anyways, new collection. Poor timing. So um, I've decided like, okay, when I start collections, I know when I first started collecting just in general, I was so eager to start new collections all the time. I was like, oh my God, I'm gonna collect every single group that I stand, every single group that I like, not even just, uh, not even stand, like I just like them. I'm gonna collect them. I'm like, I'm so, I love collecting. And then that happened and I dropped so many of them. So I decided to like, Think about it a little bit more and so for this group i was waiting for their next comeback which already happened and i really liked it you guys like i liked it so much and i was like i'm definitely gonna, sorry definitely gonna collect if like i really like their next album like i have to like a little bit of their releases in order for me to like continue to actually collect them um and I really liked it, but it was not a physical release. So I didn't collect for them. And I was like, oh, I'm gonna just, I'll wait for the next comeback. We'll see, I'll wait for the next comeback. But I thought, I've been thinking about it so much for quite a long time. And I decided just to like, you know what? Let's do it. Let's pull up a template. Let's get a wish list going. So I've started to collect. Kiss of Life, Julie. I love Julie. And I think uh, in between like Sticky and Now, like I just saw so much content with them. And I really like them, you guys. Like I am, I really like them. So ultimately after watching like a lot of their content and stuff, I really like Julie. So Julie is my bias. And that's why I'm gonna start collecting. So, I did buy a few things off Nyokyo. It's not gonna come in this package. It's gonna come in the next one. Um, very few because, like I said, like literally so many of my uh, of groups I already collect are making comebacks. So, so I'm just gonna eyeball. It. and they do have quite a bit of PCs um I am gonna collect like I found a template and it's just like an awkward because it's three it's awkward for them to be in a like a four pocket in a five instead of an a four but I don't think it's enough for me to put them in an A4. So I'm gonna keep them in an A5. And it works well because I wanted, since La Seraphim's comeback had a lot of cards, I decided to take them out of their previous one. And I this was a plan of mine for a while to um, incorporate, to have Kiss of Life in my collection and to use this binder with La Seraphim as well. So, I'm glad I can finally get this all started. Let's get everything in motion. Um, so, I put down what I have. And I'm not, because, like I was saying, there's so many, like, groups. And, like, both of my alt groups are having comebacks a week apart. And just had comebacks. Like, bo literally both of them. Um, I just, I'm... Um, I bought a few, but we're gonna, it's a slow going collection. And by the way, like I'm very okay with that. Like I don't like, like some people, they do find it stressful to like have a lot of un, like have photo card, like have collections not completed. And that's very valid. 
um, some for me as well at the beginning, like seeing so much fillers instead of photo cards. Ugh, it made me so anxious. But I learned to just not be bothered by it anymore, I guess. Plus, purple and blue look so cute together. So, you know, not all bad in the world. Um, so... I am gonna just purchase their next album, I think. For right now, I might just, like, buy everything off Neo Kyo, And then... When they have a comeback, I'll like properly collect for them. Oh, and I'm just putting them like one after another. I'm not, there's no spreads. Start Midas Touch. So, if you can even tell on camera, like some of them have like little envelopes. Those ones there are ones that I already have on the way. Okay, so for this one here, I don't even know if this exists. Like, I didn't see it on the template, but I bought a card with Julie and Belle, and uh, I really liked it. It was so cute, but it wasn't on the template, so I wonder if it's a POB and I accidentally bought it. I mean, whatever. But it's gonna go here. I don't even know if it's my... <laughs> I don't even know if it's Midas Touch Era. <laughs> like, I might buy their jewel cases. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. I'm uncertain. I waited so long. I couldn't have waited just a bit longer. The answer is no. Um, I was like, you know what? Since all my groups are coming back, let me just let me just bite the bullet. Let's do it. And do it we did. Let me tell you. So for the moment. This only consists of their like album cards and not POBs or anything. Um, and that's what we're gonna keep it at for the moment. Just like how I collect Yunjin of La Seraphim, I'm probably gonna collect Julie of Kiss of Life, which is why I decided to put them kind of together. And uh, so far, Oh, this is going to be such a cute, like, binder to go through all the time. All the time. All the time. This is so crooked. What even? So, that's actually it for uh, my setting up video. We did go through a lot. Uh, I think we talked a lot. Um, and... The next video is going to be the haul video, and then uh, I'll probably be getting some albums in the mail, and so we'll have a few things to put away. So yeah, that's it, you guys. I hope you guys have a wonderful day, evening, or night, wherever you are, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.